right kids has impacted me in many ways just um, basically in boosting my confidence boosting my skills kids I've done many public speaking things in my school I recite poetry and I've entered my poetry in two competitions and they both got published so what this is one of the books called skating under the stars and I wrote a poem called white one of the stanzas I really like is um, white is sadness like the death notice in the carrier pigeon's beak the envelope being opened by trembling hands and the pale lifeless face of a soldier on the battlefield I like this um, stanza because it really stands out of, of the other ones as the other ones are like white is happiness white is delight but this one is more serious and it shows you the other side of the color white um, since Waiting for, for, for Kids, I've done a lot of volunteering work in my school to also um, inspire people that they can do lots of volunteer work as well. So I created pendants with my sisters and my cousins, and I raised $700 for Princess Margaret Hospital through that. And this has also inspired other people to not only just create things and sell them, but also for charitable causes because it's all, that is essentially what my book did for other people in Chile, um, literacy in Canada. My advice for young writers is to not be afraid or like um, intimidated by all these, by other people, just write. It doesn't really matter if it's good or bad. Just write whatever you think is meaningful to you. If you see something or a message that you think is really impactful to you, write it down because it just, like you keep, it's addictive. Writing is addictive, you just keep writing and writing and it's gonna evolve into a love of writing that will carry on with you throughout your whole life.